Hi, so this is my, I think my first video sort of tip I, I'm going to leave on my page. And just to very briefly explain why I do this, I like to put things out there for um, two reasons. One is uh, I found that by putting things out there, um, people comment on it. Some of the greatest players have commented on my playing and uh, have given me some fantastic tips, which has impacted the way I approach the instrument. Um, the second reason is because I've been practicing pretty diligently, and I believe if you practice, you you get better. If you practice smartly, you get better a lot faster. So over the last 10 months, since I now have time, uh, thanks to not having a day job, I've been really focusing on the trumpet. Um, admittingly, some days are more than others, but I've been pretty diligent with you know picking up the horn, going for a routine um, every day. So. Um, through uh, the help of a friend of mine, uh, Howard Moore, who is a local trumpet player, I finally got a copy of this, the uh, Charles Collin Advanced Lift Flexibility. And one of the things that always happens to me uh, is I look at a page like this and I think, wow, that's just a lot of information. So I need to find ways of managing the information. And what I've come up with for myself, uh, and you know, perhaps other players have come up with it uh, as well, but for me, I always ask, well, what can I do to make it easier for me? Uh, one of the things I do is I sort of uh, put markings on the page that group the notes into th groups of three notes. And that sort of helps me follow along and, and sort of keep time and uh, make it a little bit more manageable. Now, I suspect once I start getting into the book more and more, I won't need to do that. But as a starting point, um, for me, this, uh, this makes sense. Um, the other thing I try to do is I try to consolidate certain elements of, of my routine uh, because I can't just keep on adding things on. Uh, I still have you know a, a set amount of time I can practice every day. Um, so for this specific example that I'll give you, I've added on um, a lips, an octave lip slur at the end. That gives me a bit of a ranged workout too. So anyone following along, this is uh, page 18, very top line. <laughs> 